With nearly 20 updates to the game since it was released in 2016, No Man's Sky has gone from something people love to hate on to a sprawling space adventure packed with features, and the developer just keeps adding new ideas to the game. Right after releasing the Sentinel update as the first of 2022, creator Sean Murray has been speaking to IGN.com about the future of No Man's Sky. Murray explained that the team is constantly coming up with new feature ideas for No Man's Sky and that with every major update like Sentinel, new inspiration is found for the future. Murray said, I'm amazed that the energy levels are as high now as they've ever been. We tend not to talk about what's on that list publicly, but suffice to say that we're not done yet by a long shot. Back in September 2021, it was also revealed that Hello Games is working on another new game that is also huge and ambitious like No Man's Sky, but that the team has learned its lesson when it comes to talking about games too early, after the controversial state No Man's Sky was released in. The Sentinel update overhauls the combat systems and enemies you'll meet in No Man's Sky, offering more of a challenge than before. Hello Games says that while the experience is always going to be about exploration, there have always been elements of hazard and danger, including the Sentinels that police the planet for wrongdoers. There's new weapons including a shotgun, active camo and even a stun grenade, with the ability to now program mechs to protect you in combat as well. It's another huge update for the game which has seen multiplayer be added after release, a new generation console version, a VR version, and just recently the team announced a Nintendo Switch version would be coming around halfway through 2022, and that edition will include all the updates to date when it's released. For more on No Man's Sky, and for what's new and what's next, head to NME.com.